because that was number one on the day that you got married. Lots of memories, uh, going up to Auntie Betty's a lot and uh, meeting Raymond for the first time and he made us laugh so much we thought he was a keeper. And he said to buy what he drank and he, just, yeah, and he stole the same. <laughs> Your memories are photographs. And my memories are photographs. I took a photograph at the wedding at the Royal Hotel and got it wrong. So the famous photograph of Mum with, with a, a, a wild shade on her head was purely accidental. Now there's somebody else who would like to come and say happy anniversary to the best Scouse accent there. Happy birthday. That's Irish. <laughs> 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 Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Paul McCartney's saying happy anniversary to you both and hope you have a lovely day. Hi Raymond, hi Meg. First of all, before we start, we would like to <laughs> um, but congratulations to the two of you on reaching that milestone of fifty golden years of marriage. That is a that is an achievement. I just hope you both have a lovely time celebrating with the family. Um, I know it's these times that we're in the new, we can't all come together for to, to really celebrate. But I hope you have a nice time, whatever you're planning for your celebration. God bless. God Love bless. you both. Hi, Megan Raymond. Happy 50th anniversary. Cheers. Cheers. Hi Raymond and Meg, 50 years, congratulations, what an achievement, thank you, thank you for being our friends, uh, we've known you for over 30 years and it's been wonderful getting to know you. Love you too. Have, have, a, have a wonderful evening with your family. Uh, we will catch up and have a meal together yes. at Margaret's favourite restaurant. Definitely. Oh, nice. Thank you. <laughs> Love you too. For being our pals. Yes, thank you.
Hi Raymond, hi Meg, greetings from Ochiltree from Sadie and Robert. Many congratulations on your golden wedding anniversary. Hope to see you soon. Yeah, that would be great to meet up as soon as we can. Um, it's been a hard time recently uh, with the COVID, but the COVID doesn't stop the sun, so we're out here enjoying uh, a wee refreshment. Um, we're actually in holiday just now. We're supposed to be in Mallorca, but here we are out the back enjoying our culture. So cheers. See you soon. See you soon. Bye. Bye. Your special poem. Many years have passed since your wedding day. We were together a lot back then and really have to say, happy times they've mostly been. Some sad bits, we'll agree. So try to focus every day on good times that you see. On so many occasions we've had a great time, whether just at home or sometimes out to dine, from East Kildbride, Cranberry, Mabel and perhaps Ayr, the food was quite acceptable, perhaps then healthier fare. Dogs, Koran, Max. Dogs, Koran and Max were a big part of our lives. Days spent at the seaside enjoying the tides. White and orange beetles, the mode of transport then. Good for getting on the sand and of course off again. We've even worked at the same places in Ochen Lake. Ochenlick Academy. We girls took up spaces for Glen. The boys worked for many a year in Glasgow and Air, hoping he'd not appear. Children eventually came along and we had no time to go, go out. Jonathan was the first to arrive. Godfather? Then there was no doubt. Jennifer and Gillian were the next two on the scene. Born just a few days apart. Lara and Matthew then followed on. Two families with a great start. After the youngsters had made their way, left home, got married and gone astray, we could pick up where we had once been, going out to meeting in places we'd never ever seen. Where, when, where have we been that we enjoyed most? Perhaps places near the coast. But now we've travelled more further away, from air to drawing less pans, lovely bay. John's 60th birthday was down at Scar Top. The vintage cars just about managed to stop. Done driving, Marion almost missed the bend. Poor breaks the problem on the way to Colvend. We had a few outings, Marion in tow, for Forty's outfit were needed to go. We ate well and watched cars from every bend. Yes, Goodwood Revi Revival was a good weekend. Weekend. Another trip with a lot less hassle was meeting up at Glenapp Castle. Wine cellar Glen Eagles was a good night too. Our French friends amazed as Lisa's bagpipes blew. Kiwi Lodge we thought was posh, with just enough to pay to ease is as the Chever Dior Chever Dior what a wonderful day. Do you both deserve to enjoy your life now? Why yes, you've done it together. Why not take a bow? This time has been bad for everyone, but glad we have all hopefully done the best for ourselves and those we love should now should we now leave all our prayers with God above? 